Hi, I'm Rabbi Alon Ferenczi of Heska Muna Synagogue in Knoxville, Tennessee, addressing you with a continuing series of Torah tidbits to get you thinking for the Shabbat to come. This Shabbat is Parshat Vayikra, the first several chapters of Leviticus, detailing the order of sacrifices as well as the particulars of each animal, and then later on the methods of expiation for transgression for crossing the boundaries of mitzvot, of the commandments of God and community. Tucked away a few times is the concept that blood and fats belong to God, that each animal that is offered up as sacrifice, parts in most cases, are eaten either by the person who offers the sacrifice or the, by the priest himself. But reserved ever for God are the blood and the fats cannot be consumed by human beings, for they are the life of the animal. It brings to mind the concept in Judaism, lifnim mishrat hadin, going within, or as we might say in English, beyond the letter of the law, taking less than one is due, taking less than one is required, taking what one needs rather than what one wants, and reserving some, either our own internal energies or some of our gifts, or some of our wherewithal and treasure for others, perhaps for a broader community, perhaps for charities or volunteer work, or perhaps simply to save it for the holy, to sanctify it to God for Sabbath and study, to give it away to something greater than us, a cause, a confession. So I invite you to experience something that isn't particularly Jewish, but to be a little monkish this week and take less than you want, maybe only as much as you need, and reserve the blood, the fat, certain sacred and delicious parts of you for something greater than yourself. Shabbat Shalom. If you enjoy talks like this and others, please do like, share, and subscribe to Eclectic Cleric, one word, on YouTube. And be sure to retweet and share this on Facebook, Twitter, and your other social media.